There are 17 days left until they retire the Adapt to All Situations Challenge, which means that I need to place first in 13 more games within 17 days if I am to become a god. And when I do, I'll be so thankful that I'll rebrand and start a cult called the Church of Thankfulness. And we can all come together and be unconditionally thankful for everything forever. Thank you for this challenge. I'm grateful already. Okay, so this wasn't supposed to be a replay, but if you haven't seen the arena replays yet, they are pretty smooth. They work really well. And, uh... I think that uh, the design is really good. So I played as Pike, and I didn't really expect us to get a win on this one. So um, I didn't record it. It was supposed to be like a warm-up game, but um, yeah, I didn't even I didn't even buy any items. So you look here. So I've got no items. And then uh, here's my augment. We got beginning to end, and then Shivana got phenomenal evil. And we really let Shivana shine in this uh, this game. So I pretty much played support. I just did CC bait. I uh, absorb damage and uh, execute. But yeah, I, I did very little damage myself. I was just kind of goofing around the whole time. All right, so here's our second item purchase, and I will be buying my first stat. Got two stacks of Dark Harvest already. All right, so here we got 154 health. So on Pike health, uh, Pike doesn't build extra health. He actually converts it into attack damage. And then he scales health naturally only with levels. The fighters fund providing your items and I think you It's good flash on Shivana. I took a portal here, but there wasn't really anywhere to go. No flowers were up yet, and I couldn't get that one. I didn't mean to dodge that kunai. I actually wanted to stun her, but she moved out of the way, so we kind of just juked each other. See, if I had just gone in on Akali here, I probably could have won this. I didn't even realize how low she was because I was looking at Mordekaiser. I was trying to focus on bringing Shivana back, but it didn't work out. I should have just gone in. Although they are very bursty, so they probably could have taken me out either way. Oh, and I, uh, I got a Regicide. And I held on to that until the last match, I believe.
Brilliant cue on my part. So right here, I probably could have survived if I went up and around. But I thought that I could get that flower before QR caught up to me. Fjord is very fast, so there's no chance. Alright, we got an item purchase here. So we're gonna get we're gonna get our first Not our first anvil, but like our first big group of anvils. Uh, we also got Dark Harvest, so let's see. We've got Ability Haste and Health. Here we add Lethality. And Crit Chance. One, two, three, four. What am I missing? I'm only reading four stats. I might be going crazy. But I think maybe I got a little bit of... Uh, something stacked there. I can't figure out which one it was. Oh, that's cool. So if I if I press numbers, I can switch to different people. What number am I? Okay, Shivana's five. Wait, it only got. <laughs> It only goes up to five. What? Well, at least I can press five to go to Shivana if I die. Ooh, I got popped there. So Lisa's totally burned. Alright, so we got item purchase here. We're going to grab more stats. Okay, I got armor. More health, yep, more health. I got it looks like I doubled up on armor too. Yeah, numbers are getting too big to keep track of with my own brain only. We got a heal and shield power. Crit chance. I probably already said that. 
Oh, I'm not in the right place. Oh, here we are. Oh, yeah. Samira. So, this was kind of a, a funky match, because... I was missing a lot of skill shots, and the Samira was kind of freaking me out. And then she kept blasting me. So then right here, I got really torn between whether I should have gone into the bush or revive Shivana. Because I could use a QE combo from the bush on Samira and then get Shivana, but it was like, it was really time constrained. So I was like, oh, maybe I should just revive her. But yeah, so that's why I lost that match and got flustered. All right, we got a buy round here. Oh, I didn't show you what my other outfit was. Uh, I guess I can't view it right now. Hey, let's see how the directed camera goes. Okay, Mordekaiser, bonking. Alright, now we can check this. Alright, so I did get restart. These guys didn't notice the circle timer circling around me. Oh yeah, this is a uh, augment selection phase, and I got a pretty excellent augment here. It was dashing, and then uh, Shivana got big, got Goliath. And in this match. I kind of just did nothing, for real. I just did a little bit of CC, but Shivana just took them out. I guess Tyr was tired of my shit. <laughs> Huge. This champion was big. He did so much damage. What was he doing, lethality? I think he was lethality. Pantheon. Yeah, lethality. Riven and Fiora. It's time for revenge. They beat us before. So right here, I'm just gonna bait and Riven out. Execute. We gotta go get Fiora. So I just do. Just kind of a CC chain as best I can. She does get away. But too much for nothing. My E cooldown is insane, and I got the money for that. I got the money for that execute. Shivana got the kill, 
But since I cast before she got the kill, and she got the kill before my cast landed, I got the money. Okay, this is a stat selection phase. We're at 15 now. Ability haste is still at 32. Attack damage 29. Armor 76. Magic resist 95. Health stick 72. Attack speed 39%. Crit chance 28.8% and lethality 14. Oh, and heal and shield power 10.8%. So those are the the anvils. Additional stats. I've got 17 anvils now. Oh my. So some of it went up after I read it. Health 924. Crit chance is 49%. Oh, that's not a good, not a good R. But it doesn't really matter because Shivana is hitting so hard that everybody dies in a couple hits. And as long as I can, like, oh, okay. So watch, watch this. So I, uh, <laughs> I get outplayed by Timo because he poisons me, and he's got those little grubs, right? And so. I burn out before I'm able to get him low enough for an execute. Yeah, as long as I can keep someone off of Shivana, it's Tier's gonna win one one v one each time. But if I fuck it up, he dies, and then I gotta you know bring him back. I love the cute little hat, the little Teemo hat on Choga. Okay, we got a buy round, so we're gonna watch these two. These two teams duke it out. This Choga is an absolute giant. 11,463 health. All of these just. Blasted by a set. NPC. So we still got to beat both of them. We got... We're in third place now. Out of three. So essentially last. And... We lose 45 team health if we lose. And both both of us are at 30. So one of our teams is about to be out. We're up against the Cho Gap. Sinjal. Chavon is chopping him up. Killed Sinjal. I got Earthquake. Oh, I forgot to tell you that. I got Earthquake. So I've got Earthquake and Dashing. Absolutely wonderful combo. So, I still have just the one item regicide. And then we got from beginning to end, restart, dashing, and earthquake. Shivana has 292 stacks on Phenomenal Evil. Thread the Needle, Goliath, and Jewel Gauntlet. Dual Gauntlet was big too. A challenger has entered and he's going kind of a max health uh, AP build almost, like AP 80 hybrid. Got a Rabadon's for his Phenomenal Evil. And then with AD for the rest. Max health damage. I'm going down here to heal. Okay, we got, uh, we got the Pantheon out. I don't think I properly executed right there, so I didn't get any money for it. But right here we're being really cautious. I'm trying not to run over a bunch of shrooms. I'm just kind of let Shivana absorb most of that. And then if I can get close enough, I'll pull him. Try and get a CC lock so that he can't 
keep running away, running away the slippery little rat. This will be the last round where you're purchasing more, uh, more items, and this is what I was talking about. So if you look here. We didn't, um, we got 30 anvils, so I had to sell my item, so I sold my item, got 30 anvils, but I never got the prismatic shard, the prismatic, uh, anvil shard. Shard holder, value, whatever it's called, you know what I'm talking about, dang it up. Yeah, we went full send there on, on Pantheon, and then I used my flash with my E there to lock down Teemo. And that was a GG.